Installing, activating, and removing plugins should be treated with care. And maybe you don't want people to go in and have that facility. So if I go and click add new plugin, I'm going to get asked for a password. Even if I just say show me the plugins, it's not going to do it. I need to enter in a password and I'm going to drop it in. In fact, it's just one, two, three, and I'm going to hit submit. And now I can go in and this will remember me because of my session. So if I've already logged in, each time I go over to plugins, I don't have to keep popping in the password, but I locked it down with a free code snippet. The link for this is in the video description. This basically just restricts access to the plugin page. And this is where you would go and set your password, save changes, activate. And that's basically it. OK, so it now means that, you know, if anyone, another client or someone else has got access to the back end of the website, when they try to go over to plugins, it ain't going to work for them unless they know the password. Hey, I'm Imran Web Squadron. See you soon. Never break, always fight, never quit. Do it right, play the game, win it life. Have no shame, there's no time. Feel the pain, let the grind. I could change in my mind. Pick a lane, commit and climb. The only way to win it life. I never miss that fact. Taking big swings.